He's muted out. I don't hear him. Yeah, we don't have volume from Charles. Volume from me? There we go. Take All it, right. Charles. Hello, everybody. It's Charles, and I'm live here in the Hangout. I, I made a commitment to come out and hang out with everybody uh, every night, and it is a pleasure for me to hang out with some new folks. Um, I'm using my cell phone, so if I get uh, sideways, it's because I'm getting tired. So I'm only going to talk for a few seconds because I have some great people on the call. Uh, you guys, please make sure you invite everyone you can to this Hangout so they can learn more and more about this exciting opportunity, learn about some skills, techniques, and even some secret uh, you know, sneak peeks of uh, some of the stuff that we have going on. So without further ado, it is my privilege to introduce to you the host of tonight's call, and that's Ryan Conley. Ryan Conley is a beast out there. He's been in a lot of other type of opportunities. He's been at the top of the opportunities that he has, has been associated with. And tonight, he's going to host our call and introduce the rest of the players in the Hangout. You're not going to see me too much more through this Hangout because my arm is only so strong to hold up my cell phone. But I will be here in spirit. And, uh, and if uh, you don't mind, are you ready to take it away there, Ryan? Yes, Charles. Thank you very much. Awesome. I appreciate it. You guys, I, I just want to say, first of all, that it is such an honor to be here in this Hangout right now. And to watch the momentum as we build this through the week and when... Typically, I take the time off with my family, try to be with my family as much as I can during the weekend. Uh, but to these numbers, we're watching these numbers jump up. Um, I, I think, uh, let's see here, uh, Christopher, what are we up to right now? One second, we're muted out. Uh, but Oh, no, I got it. Can you guys hear me? There we go. Um, we are, we're, we're nearing 300 people on a Sunday night, guys, watching awesome. the Hangout. And let me refresh because I'm loving this number. And then I'm going to shut up because my voice is out. 8,602. 8,602 people in Canada. Woo. Wow. That, that is just phenomenal. And uh, I, what, what we're seeing out there basically is a lot of people, they've lost their jobs out there. You know, the economy is getting tougher and tougher. And we can just smell that there's something in the air that uh, there's something that's got to go ahead and help solve this issue out there and really just build hope in people because it's nice to see where people have hope in their eyes right now. It's, it's just contagious out there, especially for those people out there that are facing some really difficult times. I mean, a lot of us have children and stuff, and uh, we've got an obligation as a parent to take the best care we can of our families. And uh, this, I tell you, this opportunity right there, I just see such great things ahead for all of us that are willing to work. This is not like a free handout any, uh, for anyone out there, guys, just because the product is just, it's so amazing. I mean, it, it's so cool. We don't even mention the company's name. We don't make any medical claims whatsoever. And that's something we'll talk about a little bit more in detail later on this evening. But uh, CBD, uh, the, the, the demand for this is so high right now. Uh, okay, and <laughs> no pun intended whatsoever right there, uh, that uh, people are learning about it. And um, it's we're seeing people that have never really had success in network marketing, and just because the product's so great out there, we're seeing this thing move. So um, i just like to introduce uh, everyone to the call here tonight. Uh, and uh, you guys, as you're listening on this call, if you'd please just go ahead and text message and get this out there on social media, bring in more people on this. We want, we're going to be holding this call every single night. So uh, get your people on this. Uh, first of all, I want to go ahead and introduce uh, uh, Christopher Carr, uh, 18 years old over here, guys. Um, and the, 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 the topic of this call, guys, is aspire higher tonight. So go ahead and keep that in mind, aspire higher. And we did really our best to go ahead and bring in some young bucks on the phone tonight and stuff just to see because it's such a great opportunity. I mean, Christopher, uh, you know, being 18 years old, I can, I, I can, what is it like to have this opportunity in your hands? And what have you seen at your age out there that has kind of uh, uh, brought you to network marketing? Hey, Ryan. Yeah. Uh, can everyone hear me? Yeah. Okay, awesome. Yeah, so I just wanted to say that thank you so much for having me all on this uh, panel. It's awesome. I'm just so thankful and uh, humble as well to be brought on here. And I just want to say, uh, first and foremost, uh, you can ha be, do, and have anything it is that your heart desires. And, you know, being 18 years old here in this network marketing industry and, you know, really in the market as an entrepreneur really is one of the most humbling as well as the most unparalleled opportunity that you can have is really getting in and starting something for yourself that you can have 
to be, you know, for your entire life. That way you can make residual income. You can make any type of income it is that you want, right? You're not capped off by having to be uh, an employee of someone. You can really go and cut your own path. And this is what this company is going to be able to do for each and every one of us, I'm sure. And one of the other things I'm really excited about is just the fact that we're on the cutting edge here with this company. Man, I, I think you're going to be the next Eric Worre or something like that. I, I, I think <laughs> kids are reading uh, Robert Kiyosaki here in high school, man. And it's just, it's so awesome, Christopher, to see. Yeah, you, I, I've got a six year old and a one and a half year old, and just seeing you know, younger generations coming in into the knowledge that you guys have acquired. Because all your friends are taking it into the business. This is just not the typical education that you're going to get in high school. I mean, that stuff goes in one ear out the other. But this stuff, it like just resonates with your soul right here and like your life calling and stuff. And uh, so we're really happy to have you here with us. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. The, uh, next, I'm going to go ahead and just introduce uh, um, uh, Curtis uh, Petrie here. Uh, if we go ahead and open up his I mic. And uh, Chris, uh, 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 you know, Curtis, I just want to say it was a pleasure talking to you earlier on today. And, uh, you know, you have one of the vapor pens um, in your hand and stuff right there. We can kind of just uh, flash that if that's okay. Of uh, course, of course, man. It was a pleasure talking to you earlier as well. I'm on my phone here, so kind of bear with me. I'm limited on space here. That is sexy, brother. That is sexy. Look at that thing. <laughs> Turn on the light. Let's see what that looks like. Whoa. That looks like a lightsaber or something. <laughs> You guys have your CBD today? I uh, recommend it. Stop, stop. <laughs> <laughs> so next, uh, I'm going to go ahead and bring, uh, appreciate that, to D Dominique uh, Lipinski on the phone with us. Uh, very blessed to have him on the phone. And uh, he's actually in the room with Billy Funk, uh, one of our great leaders in the company. Uh, Dominique's down in San Diego right now. And I tell you, I just wish I was down in San Diego right now just to feel the buzz what's going on down there. Dominique, how, 23 years old, another young buck. You guys, again, aspire. Okay, and we're really talking about uh, of emphasis in this chat is the younger generation. This is something we really want to get into younger people because these guys got the drive and the motivation to take our businesses. So, Dominique, great to have you with us. Thanks, Ryan. Can you hear me well? Perfect, brother. Awesome. So glad to be on this hangout with all of you guys and get to share a little bit of my experience and how excited I am about this company. And just quickly, you know, I saw network marketing as a way to leverage my time and income. And as we all know, economy is tough for a lot of people, and it's even tougher for the college people out there. So we're here to give you the most from us to, to encourage you to do more research about CBD, give you as much as information as we can personally share with you, and for you to come up with your own conclusion and get started with us in Canada. It, 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 I graduated from University of Washington myself, and, and, and with the network marketing, we're, we're coming in all these kids that are in college and stuff. And look at what we're looking at the, uh, the stats out there all these kids coming out of, and I commend everyone going to college, don't get me wrong in, in everything, just to really get that professional thing. But the coaching that we're getting, being involved in a great uh, company such as this, an opportunity and to work with the mentors uh, like uh, Christopher Hussey and also. Uh, here we have uh, who I'm going to introduce next um, is uh, uh, let's go ahead and just get right over here to um, the hemp meds owner right here. Uh, my apologies, uh, to, uh, <laughs> sorry about this. Troy Nyhart, uh, Troy, there we go. Sorry, I just I honestly um, in your in your presence to you know what a great company that you come from. I, I feel so humble. It's just I'm honestly a little mind blown right now, and I had the opportunity to explore. Um, the company website um, there that uh, you represent there at Hemp Meds, and I was blown away by the professionalism, uh, is, the professionalism, and it's nice to know that we're backed by just quality and, and talent such as yourself, brother, and uh, I, I, I look forward so much to, to forming a relationship with you and working with you with the rest of our teammates out there and just everyone else on so, those calls. Uh, here we have uh, who I'm going to introduce next um, is, uh, uh, let's go ahead and just get right over here to... Um, the hemp meds owner right here. Uh, my apologies. Uh, to, uh, <laughs> sorry about this. Troy Nyhart. Uh, Troy, there we go. Sorry, I just, I honestly, um, in your in your presence, to you know what a great company that you come from. I, I feel so humble. It's just I'm honestly a little mind blown right now, and I had the opportunity to explore um, 
the company website um, there that uh, you represent there at Hempheads, and I was blown away by the professional uh, is the professionalism, and it's nice to know that we're backed by just quality and, and talent such as yourself, brother. And uh, I, I I look forward so much to, to forming a relationship with you and working with you with the rest of our teammates out there and just everyone else on this call. So I'm going to turn it over to you right now, brother. Brian, well, thank you so much for uh, hosting the call here this evening with us, or I should say hangout. I'm so accustomed to saying a call, uh, as it shows you are as well. But, uh, you know, there's definitely a lot of exciting things going on within the, uh, the cannabis marketplace. And uh, we've been very uh, fortunate and blessed to, you know, over the last several years to, uh, you know, be backed by multiple companies who are investing, you know, over $60 million into this space to get us to where we're at today. Uh, we have a phenomenal legal team behind us, uh, you know, FDA counsel, and just a lot of rock solid scientists that totally understand the cannabis plant, the cannabinoids, and, um, you know, to be able to deliver this compound um, to the world is, is just a great feeling. So, you know, we're super excited to, uh, to have everybody involved. It was a year ago that uh, I received a phone call, and um, I went down to the corporate office, and um, I literally, I was pinching myself, uh, and I said, there's no way this can be true. And they came to me and asked me, you know, what my thoughts were to take the products to market. And, you know, I'm sitting there and I said, well, you know, the, the greatest thing to do would be to launch this through a network marketing company. And, um, you know, so as we started to dig in and just realizing if we were going to bring this to market, and I knew that the demand was going to be extremely high, uh, but I didn't realize that, the, that it was going to be like it is right now. I mean, just to put in over 8,000 people in a short amount of time since we launched the Leverage uh, Leaders launch site, is, is quite incredible. Uh, but, you know, at the end of the day, we, we sat back and said, hey, let's get all of our ducks in a row. Let's make sure that we have all of our I's dotted, T's crossed before we actually bring this to market. And then, you know, six, so about six months ago, you know, there was another tidal wave that actually hit the industry, and that was when Sanjay Gupta had come out uh, and made an announcement on CNN that, you know, and at that point in time, our phones began to ring off the hooks. So our traffic to our websites was through the roof. And that's what we have been saying and, and preaching all along about what what we had. And at that moment, it totally changed everything. And then December of uh, this year, we were getting ready to host our um, Christmas party. And I picked up the phone and I called uh, the CEO of uh, Canaway, Jeff Rogers, and said, the time is now. Why don't you come down to our Christmas party? We'd like to welcome you as a family. And uh, let's, uh, let's get Canaway up and going. And that's exactly what happened. So... We're excited to have each and every one of you with us, and um, you know we got some big things to make happen over the next few weeks. And March is going to be incredible. And when we uh, launch Cannabis Beauty to Find in April, look out! It's it's going to really uh, change everything. Yeah, Holly. Well, thank you so much for that information, Troy. And I, we, we've got some questions for you, definitely. But uh, I just wanted to uh, finish off with the youth movement uh, we have here and bring uh, Terrell on the phone with us right now. Um, Terrell uh, Vest is 18 years old, so we've got two 18-year-olds on the line with us tonight. And uh, uh, Terrell, um, whereabouts are you from, and uh, what other companies have you been with? And can you tell us how you see this different uh, at your age? You know, I just want to say thank you for having me. Um, I think it's really amazing to see a company so committed to the younger generation. Um, most companies kind of count out that generation and. Um, I think it's pretty incredible that we're um, embracing it because I think young people are uh, are, are pretty spectacular. So um, I am 18 years old, like you said. I am from San Diego, California. I am Charles Vest's son, actually, and I've been a, I've been a part of a few network marketing companies in the past. And what I want to say that sets our company different is never have you seen the ability to say so little about a product and get such an amazing reaction. So that's why I'm excited about uh, this uh, opportunity. And, and that's so cool, that these father and son combinations and see the family come together. Uh, they, to have that, that connection, I, I, sorry, I'm just going to express my emotions here. <laughs> this is kind of how I am uh, when I'm bat when passion runs through my veins like it does through all your guys'. But uh, to see families come together and have the opportunity, it seems like society has gone ahead and broken us up on so many different levels. And that's kind of been until now as the Internet's continued to boom and connect us on a global scale. We come across these financial opportunities to have that opportunity, especially in such a time of need right now. You know, you look at our forefathers and stuff, and they speak about just how 
awesome the hemp plant is and stuff. And, uh, you know, obviously it plays, it's going to be playing a major role in uh, where we go in 2014 and beyond right now. So, um, again, it's really nice, uh, Terrell, to have you with us and stuff, and to you and your father Charles as well. So, um, I'll just go ahead now. We do have Sugar on the line with us. Uh, she's helping run this. So, Sugar, I, I greatly appreciate you kind of helping uh, organize these calls like a air traffic flight control person right here. Uh, would you like to chime in at all? You're muted out there. <laughs> yeah. No, I, tur I turned my volume down because I have a little yappy dog, so I want to make sure nobody had to hear the poor little guy in the background. Chihuahua? But, um, I you know, he's a little min pin. He's very cute. But uh, he, uh, one of the things I wanted to say is that um, we've got a really great Facebook group that's going on right now, and that's where you'll probably find me if you, if you are with Canaway. And a couple of things that we've got that I just want to mention. We have so many questions, a huge barrage of questions. As the company's been growing, the Facebook group has been growing by leaps and bounds. So um, Christopher threw me in there and uh, kind of fed me to the... <laughs> <laughs> to the tidal wave of people coming in. And we had a lot of questions that were coming up over and over and over again. So I compiled a list and it continues to grow little by little, but there were some about 10 to 12 questions that everybody was asking. And so we've got a nice FAQ sheet up there for you. We've got a, a document with all kinds of helpful links. There, you know, like everybody's been saying tonight, there's not a whole lot that you need to say. You really just need to share some really simple, basic things. And we have a couple of links that are so easy to just pass them on to say, you know what, just watch this. So we've got those things for them to watch. And uh, we've got some great videos that help you understand what we need you guys not to say for sure. So there's a nice little compliance video in there. So if you just do decide to join up with Canaway and go into the Facebook group, and you will find a great group of enthusiastic, super excited people, and you'll find all kinds of questions and answers, and you're going to find me there probably 24 hours a day. So You know, it, it, thank you, Sugar. It, it's really, really important, everyone, to seriously pay attention to compliance. This, is, this goes for all of us. And... I promise you as a leader in the company that I'm going to do every time you hear, we hear something, let's get that out to the other leaders so it just radiates throughout the whole entire thing with, because, you know, this is something that uh, we all, it, it's in our best interest. And just like any other job, when you come into a job, I don't care if you're flipping burgers or whatever, you're going to learn your, the rules and see that grease is hot. You're going to learn where to put your fingers in and not, you know what I'm saying? So uh, it just... Get educated, get your people educated, and no health claims whatsoever, okay? It, we're, we're working on it. We talked about this before, Sugar and stuff, and uh, uh, um, Christopher about, you know, coming up with even a fun hashtag list. This is going to be something really cool, guys. So just to get the ju creative juices flowing, uh, just while I'm on this tangent here, we talked about, you know, hemp for life, number four life, you know, uh, CBD hashtag. We should compile, like, a cool hashtag list because... That allows us, basically, if we look at the definition of a hashtag, that basically is something that links through everything else. We didn't say it. All we said is a little word. So the less we say, the better right there. And let's just become the company of hashtags, cool hashtags, you know? <laughs> so uh, I, I just put uh, hashtags I've been using is him, you know, hashtag him, hashtag CBD. Enough said right there, guys. So um, I, just touching base on compliance is really important. We've all experienced that this week, and so thank you for everyone that's really helping get the message out there uh, so quickly when these things come to surface right there. Um, uh, Christopher Hussey, you want to go ahead and chime in off that? Uh, you've been uh, uh, helping with uh, since that also lately, so go ahead. Uh, hey, guys. Um, what did I say? We were like 200 viewers when we started, right? Yeah. We're at 500 viewers. So... So best behavior, guys, 500 people are watching. Um, <laughs> Stay